The inspiration behind our nucleus was the shape of the building themselves. They're so elegant. They're quite organic, these two beautiful vertical, like elongated ellipses. And they kind of reminded me of two upright hands. And then I saw this beautiful image where there was sunlight reflecting off one of the buildings onto the other. And I'm like, that's it, it's the spark of life. I need something that connects these two buildings. And that's when I came up with the idea of the atom. I've been working for 35 years and I've worked all over the world and I've worked with many galleries, institutions, uh, but I have to say that the experience here with this team has been second to none. First of all, the incredible positive energy that you feel all the time when you are in this space. And I decided that the best material was uh, the stainless steel wire mesh because I didn't want my sculpture to block the view of uh, these beautiful towers, but I wanted them to be part of them. And then we had uh, the atom. It was uh, such a joy for, for us to see it uh, uh, come together, come to life. My art is all about um, an emotional experience. I never conceive of a sculpture just purely for the aesthetic reason. I think that everything that I make, I wanted to say something. So first of all, uh, people have to be able to understand the work. It has to be universal, because I try to speak a universal language, the, the language of communication of, through an image, which is uh, love, which is unity, which is hope. Obviously, I'm incredibly proud, honored, and privileged to be part of uh, this amazing project, the St. Regis on the Isles Beach here in Miami, uh, the residences. For me, this is very important. I mean, it's, it's my first uh, public sculpture here in Miami, and wow, where, right? It's like a <laughs> grand entrance. So yeah, it's really a fantastic achievement and I'm so thankful to be, for being part of this amazing project.